artist, I specialise in geometric drawing, such as patterns like Mob Behind Me and Mandala Tattoo Art. So this is actually a design of mine that got screen printed onto wallpaper and we've used it to decorate in the studio. So I started tattooing when I was really young and then basically by the age of 21 I was running my own commercial studio just outside Brighton and Lewis and I've just moved from there to this which is my new studio and uh, this time around I'm doing it as a private studio so that just means that it's appointment only, it's not a retail premises and um, it's just like one person at a time so if I'm working by appointment only I'm either tattooing someone or if someone wants to come in and talk about a tattoo then we do a consultation and then I can give everyone the, the time they need and um, I can also give myself the time I need and then that makes me more focused on my artwork, less distractions like being a shop manager and um, I think that will show in my work as well and uh, I can take a bit more time out for myself so here we are. So I like to try and get out of the studio as well and learn about tattooing in other places. I've travelled many times to Borneo and tattooed with tribes there where tattooing is a big part of their history and their culture and um, it's great to learn about traditional tattooing. They actually taught me to tattoo by hand just using two sticks. It's really great meeting people like my friends in Borneo and getting taught that and then working in America. It was my most recent trip and everyone does something different everywhere. So I do conventions in cities amongst Europe, Asia, America and I also do guest positions from time to time at other people's studios and that's a great way to experience life somewhere. We try and keep things calm and casual at my studio and create like a friendly atmosphere because it's quite a nerve-wracking thing getting a tattoo, obviously it hurts and that scares people. So things like using silent rotary machines is going to be less scary than something that sounds like it's drilling or buzzing. Tattooing has actually changed quite a lot since I started. People are being like really, really artistic now and that's partly because artists are tattooists now, not just you own a machine, so it makes you a tattooist. And um, also like equipment has really helped tattooing because have come a long way. There's a lot more like predispersed pigment inks rather than the powder pigments, which just means the particles are smaller, goes under the skin easier, heals the same colour it is in the bottle, that kind of stuff. Also with trying to keep things contemporary, that's kind of the vibe of setting up my new studio. So we're actually at Rob Hurst Art Studios, they're like high-end art studios. It's a really creative hub, probably the best in Brighton. So I'm Fade FX. If you'd like to contact me, inquire about tattooing or book an appointment, my email address is fadefxtattoo at gmail.com and my website is www.fadefxtattoo.com.